Good morning, Half Pit Little Barbecue family. Got to be extra quiet. It's about 4.40 in the morning on Friday. I want to share a word of encouragement for the weekend um, and just share something that I've been studying in uh, 1 Peter chapter 3 this morning, uh, verses 8 and 9. It says, Finally, be all ye one mind, having compassion one for another. Love as brethren. Be kind-hearted. Be courteous. Not rendering evil for evil or railing for railings, but blessings, knowing that you are thereunto called, that ye should inherit the blessing. In today's society, I know it's so easy to get on one of the social media platforms and give our opinion of how someone's living their life or give our opinion of something that's going on in their life instead of picking the phone up and calling on them and sharing an encouraging word or praying for them. And uh, we all get caught up and uh, judging when we shouldn't be judges. We should leave the judging to the Lord and we should be encouraging one another, loving one another as God loved us and remember that we've all been redeemed by the Lord. And uh, I pray that we all gain more courage to reach out and uh, lift people up in this day and time. I mean, we all need encouragement at some point in our life. We all need a helping hand to lift us up. We all need someone to share a kind word with us. So this weekend, think upon it. If you get a chance, spend some time with the Lord and uh, think of a way you can encourage someone or think of somebody that's been going through something and share a message of encouragement, a message from the word of the Lord and let them know that you love them, God loves them and that you're there for them. And as always, if you love barbecuing the outdoors and the good Lord, this is the channel for you and I would like you to subscribe give a thumbs up and leave a comment and just remember God loves you and uh, we're here for you praying for you and if you need anything leave a comment reach out and uh, I'll pray with you over anything you got going on in your life and as always today's instance if you have a Bible you should be reading it